Nate Chastain, a former high-ranking employee of dominant non-fungible token, NFT, marketplace OpenSea, has been indicted for fraud and money laundering in a case federal prosecutors in the Southern District of New York characterize as insider trading in non-fungible tokens. In 2021, Chastain, then, he bought about 45 NFTs before they were featured, selling them shortly after and capturing the big increase in prices that typically followed, the indictment says. In other words, he was allegedly front-running his employer's market-moving promotions. He typically sold those NFTs for between two and five times the purchase price, the indictment says. Chastain didn't immediately respond to a request for comment and his lawyer is not yet identified in court papers. It's notable that the indictment returned yesterday and unsealed today calls the incident insider trading, because NFTs don't seem to be covered by the Securities Act of 1934, which bars insider trading in stock and other financial securities. But prosecutors are now making it clear that they won't let that technicality stop them from using federal fraud charges to go after unsavory practices in the NFT market, practices that might be charged as insider trading if securities were involved. Today's charges demonstrate the commitment of this office to stamping out insider trading, whether it occurs on the stock market or the blockchain, said U.S. Attorney Damian Williams in a press release. The fraud indictment doesn't mean NFTs are being considered securities. The crux of the charge is that Chastain used confidential information misappropriated from his employer, OpenSea, to make money, 